Man, this was real good. Late LK at One Youngster, holding it down, doing his thing, bringing you that street geek and nerd soul. And guess what? Today, I'm going to be reviewing with my girl, Lisa. Hey. Yeah, that movie, Southside with You. Man, it's good. So before we get into it, of course, ladies first, what is your score, Lisa? Um, I'd say a four. I, I'll agree. I, I give this a four out of five stars. Uh, this movie really, really just, it just hit all the right levels for me. Lisa, what you think about the film? I, it was just smooth. I, it was, it was a sweet movie. I, I think that was really the best way to describe it. It was, it was just very sweet, um, without, you know, doing any spoilers. Um, it was very sweet. Uh, no politics. If anybody was wondering if, if that's in there, it's no politics. It's simply about, you know, Barack and Michelle um, Obama. Um, I love the, the culture. They, you know, the culture, the, the art, the music. Um, it was just a sweet, cultured, elegant movie. Yeah, I think the words that I came away from with this were like sweet, quaint, cute, regal, just nice. It, w it was just a nice film. Yeah. Like uh, it, it was this great relationship that you get to see growing, of course. I mean, it's no, you know, this is no spoiler. The film is about their first date. And the thing that I liked about it is that they actually allowed them to have their date like they didn't rush it along they allowed their relationship to grow and um their their date was very very interesting and their attitudes towards each other their words towards each other uh their mannerisms it was just all very very fleshed out it was very real and just natural yeah tika sumter did a great job uh, I have to admit, I was afraid I was going to sit there the whole time, you know, thinking about, Lord, what is Candy doing? But <laughs> she did a great job. I can't remember the actor's name who played uh, Barack Obama. It's, uh, Parker. Uh, man, I can't think of his name. He right did now. an excellent job. Yeah. He did an excellent job. You could tell he had studied the president very, very well. Um, so just, just a great job. Um, the cinematography was great. I yeah. love the different angles, the different shots. That was really nice. Most definitely. Now, as far as recommending this film, would you recommend someone go see this in a theater or, you know, wait for it to come home? Uh, you know, what do you think? This isn't a must-see in the theater. Um, I, well, it isn't a must-see in the theater in terms of, you know, some movies you really need that theater experience. Yeah. However... I am encouraging everyone to go out and support while it is in the theater. Um, we can support everything else, y'all. Let's be real. We can support everything else. When they shoot them up, let's support this. Yeah, I definitely think this is... I'd say that normally I wouldn't say this is like a go out to the theater type of movie, but I definitely think this works as a date movie. Um, uh, no matter... You know, no matter the age of the couple, I think this works very well as a date movie. Yeah. Um, uh, very, very well. So I'd say, you know, you know, maybe a uh, Saturday afternoon or something like that. You know, Sunday midday. This is a great Sunday movie. Like yes. a chill Sunday. Let's just, you know, go out. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So definitely, I'm saying you guys should definitely... Uh, especially if you're thinking of a date, definitely go out and see this. But even if you're not able to catch it in the theater, this is a movie that I think is very important uh, for us to support. So if you're not able to support it in the theaters, which you should, you definitely need to go and, you know, burn it up on, you know, burn up them views on Netflix so they know that we want to see it, especially that we want to see more content like this. It's, it's just a good movie, guys. Like, it's a it's a really uh, just nice, soothing, sweet story about these two people that, you know, are beginning to fall in love. Yeah, it's it's refreshing, I guess would be a, a good yeah. word, too, from, 
you know, we have a lot of really intense movies that come out for the most part. And I think we are so used to movies just being so intense and action packed and keep us on the edge of our seat that, you know, it's, it's been a minute since, since we've had something just really nice and innocent and, and mellow. And this was that. All right. Well, of course, go see this movie. But don't forget. L.A. What Up, V.A. What Up, R.V.A. You Got My Heart. Never forget, y'all. Like, comment, and subscribe. Peace. Bye.